Today we'll be making our own soaps. So really, it, it's a really easy um, process. We've actually gone with the soap bases. So we went with two different kinds. The first one is a shea butter glycerin soap base. And this one is just a honey glycerin soap base. And so you can get creative and play around with your uh, soap bases. But these are the two that we chose to start with. This one is going to obviously, when it melts, it's going to be more of a clear soap base. Whereas this one is going to be a solid white. And so we have our four different molds. We wanted to be a little bit creative, so we got four different styles. We have the oval, the rectangle, and then just for getting all fancy and such, we wanted to get different um, patterns, if you will. So this one is a floral pattern, and this one is more of, um, I guess more of a beach theme, because it's like shells. Uh, we couldn't find Christmas ones, unfortunately, um, or holiday theme ones, so we thought these ones these ones are good for all year round, really. I mean, these are more maybe summer type soaps, but either way, who's to say that you can't be using a shell soap in the summer or winter or fall, right? So um, the next thing is we have our um, dyes, and so this is just to add a little bit of coloring to some of them. We're gonna get creative. Um, we did, however, get the Christmas, or we tried to get Christmas colors. So we have um, a green, a yellow, and I think the other one is like a rose. And then of course, we are going to, just for creativity, we're going to add our dried flowers that we had received from our Amazon shipment. So we have both rose petals and we have lavender. And we're going to top that off with our essential oils. So we have eucalyptus. We're going to be using peppermint, lavender of course, and rolls as well so we're going to do quite a few different types so if you guys want to come over quickly we honestly there's two different ways to melt your soap very easy you can either do it in the microwave or you can do a double boil method which is what we're doing right now and so all we're going to do is cut up these soaps drop them in our double boiler melt them completely and then i'm going to show you guys how we put them in our molds and then create our soaps Thank you. 
So guys, thank you so much for joining us on this DIY video. We hope you enjoyed it. And so as you can see, it's very easy to make your own DIY soaps as Kaden is opening the cupboard there. Oh, this little boy. It's so, trying to find something for me. <laughs> guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video.